Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. Yep, it's another video from me, Ange. Hi guys, welcome to my channel. If you're new, thank you so much for being here. I'm Ange, I'm a mom to two teenage boys who play a lot of sports and keep me sports broke. I'm a full-time worker, I'm a side hustler, I'm a couponer, I'm a budgeter, I'm exhausted. <laughs> That's what I should just say. All right, I hope you'll enjoy your time here. Today is a fun video. Why is it fun? Because we are stuffing our tax refund. Yes, we are. So we got back $3,176 between federal and state. I did put 76 of it into my savings challenges on my Friday video which ended up being my Sunday video, but that's okay. And then a hundred went into the buffer just to make sure, I like to make sure we're sure, you know, just always good to have that little insurance policy for my sanity, I like to call it. And so we are stuffing $3,000 tonight. 1,000 um, from our federal and 2,000 from our state. And we, we're not going to get that much back from state, but Colorado has this Tabor rule. And if they collect too much sales tax, they give it back. This year, they give it back to us on our Colorado state return. So $1,600 of that 2000 was that Tabor. Otherwise, we've gotten about $400 back. I really don't like to get big refunds because I like to try. I'm kind of a tax geek, a numbers geek. Um, and I try to get it close so that we're not loaning them our money for, you know, a whole year for free when I could be earning that interest on it, some some income. But that's just the way it worked out this year. Um, so I'm not mad. It's good. So I have it all broken down on my handy dandy little notebook. Pretty excited. Um, it was definitely fun getting to figure out how to stuff $3,000 I didn't know I was getting. So I'm going to put it over here. I did count it like 700 times, so I'm not going to count it again, but I can tell you um, there's a lot of prop bills in here as well as regular bills because one, I didn't want to get all the cash out when I was just going to put it back in my high yield and two, I didn't get enough cash out. So there's that. So that's how it's going to roll today. Um, it's mostly big bills. Um, I'm trying to put some big amounts away. Um, and so that's what we're doing. And I'm going to try not to say um anymore because that's kind of bugging me. Okay. So let's start with our normal binder, our big binder, our brown binder, our bill binder, whatever you want to call it. And we are going to put 40 in HOA just to make sure that we are ready when that bill comes out. So there's 20 and 40. How are you guys all doing? Are you having a good weekend? We're having a busy weekend. 50, 70, 90, 110, 130, 150, 170, 190, 200, which is the next amount to come out. So that's perfect. Um, let's see, Friday night I had to work late and then we ran around and I went shopping with a friend. Saturday morning I thought I had to work an hour. I ended up working four and a half hours. That's when salary isn't as fun, right? And then um, I took a walk because it was beautiful in Colorado and they canceled my son's baseball game because of the snow yesterday, but it would have been beautiful. But anyway, so I borrowed the neighbor's dog and I took a nice walk. And then um, tonight, me and Carson started filling the Easter eggs for the adult Easter egg hunt. We started filling the coins. And tomorrow, I need to do all the Sunday, prepare for the week stuff, grocery shopping, meal planning. And then Carson has a two o'clock soccer game about an hour and a half away. And then I'm meeting some of my friends from our old baseball team for happy hour. And I'm super excited about that. So my, um, my uh, mom time envelope is going to take a hit and I couldn't be happier about it. <laughs> So that's my weekend. And then um, next week is pretty crazy too. So here we go, right? All right, car insurance, I put 100 in. So I'm gonna take a prop bill for this one because it goes in the high yield. 
So now in car insurance, we have 1,000, 100, 200, 300, 400, 500, 600, 700. So 700, 800, 900, 1,050 in car insurance now. So that's exciting. I said 1,000, 100, 200, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 2,050. All right, that's good. We're growing. We're growing. And I do probably need to do a bill condensing, but I've been doing so many videos that I I was going to put it off. All right, we're putting 400 into sports. So I'm actually going to do two prop bills, one, two, and then I'm going to do two, let's see, 100, and then 120, 20, 40, 60, 81. And the reason for that is I have an IOU here still for 175. So let's see. There's the prop bills, and then... All right, so now in sports, before I pull this out, I'm not going to pull it out right now because I don't want to get confused, but 1,000, 15, 16, 1,700 will be in the high yield, 1,800, 20, 40, 60, 80, 1,900, 10, 20, 19, 20, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, I'm going to cash those in for a 20 for easier counting. So 1940, 1 and 2. 1942 in sports. And when we come back around, I will take this 175 out that we owe. And it will be less, but that's okay. Okay. Subscriptions, I'm not doing anything. Tolls, I'm not doing anything. Land payment, I am going to put $400 and fully fund it and be done. One, two, three, four. So now in here, I need a total of $1,000. 500 for 2023's land and 500 for 2024's land. Let's see what we got. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine hundred. 950, 970, 980, 990, 1003. So perfect. So this will now be fully funded, and we're going to put this fully funded slip here from Sarah on a budget. And then we know it's done. So what happens when I fully fund something like this? I'll put it in the high yield till we have to pay, and then every week I'll put a dollar in it towards the next year's just to get a little head start. So that's awesome. Union dues is getting 220 tonight, which I do believe will pay off um, the year's worth of dues. 51, 52, um, and 20. So then this would be fully funded. I don't have another fully funded. Uh, I do somewhere, I think, but 51, 52, 20, 40. 240, 245, And I believe that that will fully fund the rest of the year, but I will see. And then I will probably pay it just to be done. All right, car registration's getting 50 tonight. It's always good to fund this a little extra because everything is more than I think. Everything's more expensive, you know? So I thought, let's go ahead and put 50 in here. And then we just have a little bit extra. Okay, so now we have 1, 2, 250, 20, 40, 60, 80, 350, 20, 40, 60, 80, 450, 470, 490, 510, 530, 540, 545. So 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. So I cannot... How is that possible? Let's see. One, two, three, four, five. And I said 545. One, two, 250, 20, 40, 60, 80, 350, 20, 40, 60, 80, 450, 470, 490, 510, 530, 545. Okay. I must have counted wrong last week and colored an extra one in. 
or maybe I took some out of here for the registration. I can't remember. Anyway, that's what's in there. Property taxes is getting 50. Just a little bonus in here. We will be paying a lot of this next month. So we're gonna put $50 in prop. So now in here we have 1,000, 2,000, 3,000. 31, 32, 33, 3,400 in high yield. 35, 36, 37, 38, 39, 4,000, 1, so 4,150, 20, 40, 60, 80, 4,250, 20, 40, 60, 80, 350, 20, 40, 60, 80, 450, 20, 40, 60, 80, 550, 20, 40, 60, 80, 650, 620, 625, 26, 27, 28, 29, 30, 4,630. I don't remember what I said for, let's see, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 45, okay, so that was 545, okay. So 4630, about 4500 will be coming out for the property taxes. So we're already saving for the next year's, which is good. That envelope is chunky. All right, and then homeowners is also getting 50. I thought I'll just throw an extra 50 in there too. So I'm going to put, let's see, I'm going to put 2040. 50 in and I'm going to take a prop 100. There we go. All right. So then homeowners will now have, and I'll go through my high yield after I'm done with this and make sure all of the binders match. 1,000, 100, 200, 300, 400, 500, 1500 1600 will be in the high yield 20 40 60 80 17 20 40 60 80 18 20 40 60 80 19 20 40 60 80 2000 20 40 60 80 21 5 10 15 20 25 30 35 40 doing a little bill exchange right now 40, 41, 42, 43, 44, 45, 46, 47, 48, 49, and 50. All right, so one more time. 1,000, 1,500, 1,600, 20, 40, 60, 80, 1,700, 20, 40, 60, 80, 1,800, 20, 40, 60, 80, 1,900, 20, 40, 60, 80, 2,000, 20, 40, 60, 80, 1, 2,150. All right, that's good. Not quite halfway there, but we're doing well. Should be ahead of the game, and hopefully there's not too much inflation next year, but I'm not holding my breath. Okay, so this binder is done, and it is getting fat, fat, fat. Okay, so next we're gonna do this binder. Household's getting 50. I'm going to put 50 in and take 100. All right, so now household has 1, 2, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 206. And we are building this back up from the hot water heater taking it off. So ideally, I'd like it around $1,000, but we've never got there before. Miscellaneous isn't getting anything. Gifts is getting 25. So 20 and five in gifts, just to plump this up as we have some birthdays coming up. One, two, three, 20, 40, 340, 345, 46, 47, 48, 49, 350, one, two, three, and four. 354 in gifts is a great amount. 
if I got to 500, I would consider it fully funded personally, but I don't know if we'll ever get there. We tend to take out pretty often. Vacation is getting a hundred. I'm going to use a prop bill for this. So in the high yield, we now have five, six, seven, eight, nine, 1,000, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 1,000. I'm going to switch that out. So 1,100, 200 in the high yield. So 1,200, 1250, 1270, 1290, 1310, 1320, 1325, 26, 27, 28, 29, 30, 31, 32, 33, 34, 35, 36, 37, 38, 13, 38 in vacation. And this could probably have 10,000 in it and it wouldn't be enough. <laughs> All right, clothing is getting 75, which I know is a lot. But let me tell you why. 21, 2, 3, 4, 5. Okay. Um, I don't know if I want to put it out in the universe yet. I'm scared. Okay. I applied for a job at my work. And if I get it, I have to start dressing up. Like right now I wear jeans and a nice shirt. Or in the summer I can wear shorts and dress. Because I work in like a rec center. But if I get this job, I have to dress up every day. So I might have to buy a whole new wardrobe. So I put 75 in here just in case I have an interview on Monday. Wish me luck, guys. I'm, I'm so nervous. I'm so nervous. I, I kind of want to keep backing out because I'm not good with change. Like, I, I'm comfortable where I'm at. I've been there for a long time. And I'll still be with the same place, but it'll be different. Anyway, wish me luck. Okay, clothing now has 50, 70, 80, 90, 95, 96, 97, 98, 99, 100. So I'm not going to buy a ton with that, but I did buy some clothes for the interview. So that'll probably eat that up anyway. I probably should have put more in there, but oh well. All right, entertainment is getting 25. And we used to have entertainment full and we wiped it out and then spring break's coming. So who knows what's going to happen here. I just want to plump it up a little. 100, 120, 130, 140, 141, 42, 43, 44, 45, 46, 47, 48, 49, 50, 51, 52, 53, 54, 55, 56, 156. And my happy place with entertainment is around $500, but that's still okay. All right, and this is self-care. Self-care is getting 25. Self-care pays for haircuts and pedicures and all the good stuff. Um, so 25 in there and 100, 200, 220, 230, 235, 36, 37, 38, 39, 40, 241, 42, 43, 44, 45. 245 is a pretty good amount in there. I imagine the boys will be asking for haircuts soon. Although Jake went with his baseball buddies last night and came home with a, um, teammate given, mullet for baseball season so he might not need a haircut soon i probably just want to wear a hat but anyway that's that's uh boys boys will be boys right air conditioning's getting 25 uh i am saving up to replace our air conditioner and our furnace that is original to our house and um when it goes we're gonna need to save a lot of money so i'm slowly saving up and hoping we get through another year so there's 1,000, 2,000, 25, 26, 27, 2,800 in the high yield towards it, 28, 20, 40, 60, 80, 90, 2,900 now. Getting close to the $3,000 mark there. I think we'll need about 10 if I'm being honest. I don't know, but I'll just keep saving. All right, and giving is not getting anything even though it's empty. It has a savings challenge that I'm working on. Mom time is getting 20. And that's just because I was planning for tomorrow night when we go out. So now mom time has 50, 60, 70, 1, 2, and 3, which should be plenty. I also have a savings challenge going for mom time, so it should get replenished pretty quickly. So that's okay. All right, Shop Small isn't getting anything, which makes me sad, but I have been buying a lot, so that's okay. PTO is getting 160. 
Um, let's do 40 in and take 200 in prop because I like to keep that in the high yield. And this is just, my husband does not get paid time off. So I save it so that when we're on vacation or something, the budget doesn't completely collapse. So now PTO, paid time off, has 1,000, 100, 200, 300, 400, 500 in the high yield, 1,500. Is that right? Yeah. And then 16, 17, 1705. And I feel like if I get it to 2000, that would be great. So we're getting close. All right. Driver's Ed is getting 10. And I don't typically put that much in here. But I just want to be prepared. So why we had a little extra, I put a little extra. 20, 25, 30, 31, and 32. This is towards Carson's driving driver's ed, which is a couple years away, but not as far as I always think. So I'm just going to get started now. Our driver's ed costs about $550 to $600. Holidays is not getting anything, but I do have a savings challenge I'm almost done with for this. And it has one, two, 20, 40, two, 56. And there's a savings challenge coming, although I will spend quite a bit. We host Easter and we do breakfast, and then we do an adult Easter egg hunt with cash, coins, and lottery tickets. So I'll probably use a lot of that. PO Box is not getting anything. Um, and then Senior Year is getting $10, just to give it a little bit more. So I'm going to do two, ten, two fives. So Senior Year here has... 5, 10, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 26, 27, 28, 29, 30, 31, 32, 33, 34, 35, 36, 37, 38, 39, 40, 41, 42, 43. And I also have a savings challenge going for it. And once we do that, we will stuff it and that'll be a great amount to stuff. All right, this binder is also getting fat. All right, and then this next binder, we're going to do car maintenance. We're putting 25 in there. I do need to get an oil change. Jake is taking his car tomorrow for an oil change, and then we'll probably take mine another day coming up soon. So now we have 100, 150, 200, 220, 230, 240, 241, 42, 43, 44, 45, 46, 47, 48. 8, 49, 50, 51, and 52. 252 in car maintenance. And again, uh, ideally, I would love to see that around $1,000 just to feel comfortable. All right, medical is getting 25. I do like to bump this one up, but right now we do have my FSA, so it's less pressure. Um, last year, by the end of the year, the FSA was gone, so we were using cash, so then we blew through it. So I'm just trying to prepare in case that happens again. 100, 20, 40, 60, 82, 20, 40, 60, 260, 265, 66, 67, 68, 69, 70, 71, 72, 73, 74, 75, 76, 77, 78. So is that 278? Yeah, 278 medical. Um, I'd be happy with five. I'd prefer a thousand. Okay. And this is education education is getting 50 because we just keep blowing through it huh. how do i not have change all right hold on i gotta make some change here medical isn't one we're gonna touch for a while so i'm gonna put a prop 100 in so 20 40 60 80 85, 86, 87, 88, 89, 90, 91, 92, 93, 94, 95, 96, 97, 98. Okay, that's not going to work. 20, 40, 60, 80, 1. And then I'm going to put a prop bill because medical we shouldn't have to touch soon. So this still has 1, 2, 20, 40, 60, 65, 66, 67, 68, 69, 70, 71, 72, 73, 74, 75, 76, 77, 78. Okay. Still has 278 perfect okay so we're gonna try this again education gets 50 so 20 40 and 50 so now it has 120 40 50 1 2 3 and 4 154 we 
which is not enough. I do have a savings challenge going for it though, which will give it a nice bump, but we go through it quick here. House Reno is getting nothing. Jake, uh, this is our savings. It's getting 200. So I'm gonna put two prop bills in here. So now it has 1, 2, 20, 40, 50, 60, 260, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, so 270, 273 in savings. That was a good bump for that one. And then Jake's savings is getting 20. Um, Jake is getting his own table refund, so... Um, he doesn't need as much, but it's what we're giving, so that'll help him because he's trying to not work during the baseball season, so that'll help him when he gets that refund. 1,100, 200, so 1,200 in the high yield for Jake, 20, 40, 60, 80, 90, 1,300, 10, 20, 25, 26, 27, 28, 29, 30, 31, 32, 33, 34, 35, 36, 37, 38, 39, 40, 41, 42, 43. So 13, 43 for Jake. And Jake had a savings challenge that already hit his last week. Carson's is still in progress. So Jake probably has more than Carson right now, but that's why. All right, and Carson's getting 20 as well. So now he has 500, 600, 700, 800 in the high yield, 20, 40, 60, 80, 900, 5, 905, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21. 921, um, we put more in Jake's typically just because he's going to be, well, he is driving, um, and so his is more, but Carson's is getting up there. All right, Roth IRA is getting 100. I'm really trying to get my investing up so I can build up some dividends for the future. So I need I actually want to trade this out for 100 from Carson. Because this is going into a different account, so I need cash. All right, so I'm putting a crop bill in 20, 40, 60, 81. That works. And then this will go in the high yield for Carson, and he'll just earn more interest, so it's a win win, really. All right, so in the high yield gets the 100, and we have 20, 40, 60, 81, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15. 115, and we do have a savings challenge going towards Roth as well. So that'll be good. We'll just keep trying to get those dividends. I am hoping to do a video on dividends, but I don't know. I don't know if it's gonna work. I, I don't know. All right, new car is getting 300. So I'm gonna use prop bills. One, two, three. And when we get to 1,000, we'll make another extra payment. So right now we're at 350. And I have a couple of little savings challenges to go toward this, so who knows? It might not be long. March is going to be a plentiful month for us. We got our income tax. It's a magic month for my husband, and I should get my raise um, from this year's merit and then possibly a little bit cash out because I'm topped out. But they raised the range a little bit, so I should get a little bit of a raise and a little bit of a like, cash out. So we'll see. All right, Christmas is getting 100 so I'm just going to take this $100 placeholder with Santa on it. And so now we have 100 20 30 40 150 160 in Christmas, which is great. We're just going to keep adding to it. Uh, I am working my apps off for Christmas, but I always want to be prepared. Apps definitely aren't paying what they used to. And my kids are more expensive than ever, so this way we have it saved up and we're ready to go. All right, and deductible is actually not getting anything tonight, and this binder barely closes. All right, so then the next plan is minis are going to get an extra 50. 
All right, here's what I need to do. I need to cash out these props because for the rest of this, I need cash. So one minute, please. I should have planned better. Let's see. Car maintenance probably has... Um, I want to pick something that can sit there for a little bit. So that's going to be, let's see, car maintenance. I'll take 200 and then I'll put 200 in the high yield. And then medical. Uh, I feel like I already did medical. Education I use too much. Reno. Does Reno have enough? Because if so, I'll take it. Let's see. 20, 40, 60, 80, 85, 86, 87, 88, 89, 90, 91, 92, 93, 94, 95, 96, 97, 98, 99, 100. Perfect. All right, I'll put this in here, and then that will take care of Reno. All righty. So now that 300 cash is available, that's perfect. So I'm gonna do this, just put it away. All right, 60, 80, 85. Okay, so here's what we're gonna do. Um, Letterbox is gonna get 35, so one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 26, 27, 28, 29, 30, 31, 32, 33, 34, 35. And it may not be these ones, um, but it'll get 35 ones. And then Minis is getting 50. One, two, 50 extra over the normal 50. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty, twenty-one, twenty-two, twenty-three, twenty-four, twenty-five. That's a star book. Do you see that? Twenty-six, twenty-seven, twenty-eight, twenty-nine, thirty, thirty-one, thirty-two, thirty-three, thirty-four, thirty-five, thirty-six, thirty-seven, thirty-eight, thirty-nine, forty, forty-one, forty-two, forty-three, forty-four, forty-five, and 50. I know I need ones for the minis, but for now that will work and I'll buy them out of one of these other binders because they all have a lot of ones. And then this should be, oh, Pooey, how do I have extra money? I did it again. I added it so closely. So mad. All right, 100, 200, 220, 240 is going into sinking funds and I have $60 left. Where did I miss guys? I added this up so many times. 240, 290. That one I didn't even add right. Okay, did I forget to put in something? I know I put it in there. I feel like I did everything. All right, well, I have $60 to figure out where it goes. If not, it'll just go into sinking funds. Um, I'm gonna rewatch the video. Oh, I'm sorry. And we'll figure it out. But yay for tax refund. I'm excited to do this money. That will be fun. I'm gonna do that in a different video. Um, my next video will be Monday minis and I might mix it with the letterbox since it's only 35. And then the sinking funds will be with the sinking funds this week. I'm trying to finish some of those up which will bulk up, bulk up this money some more. All right, guys, $3,000 dispersed, and I got some fat, fat binders. So a condensing will be coming soon. Also, I want to get that money in the bank and earning interest for me. And then I have my Monday minis, and then I'll have my regular stuffing. So you're not done with me yet. So thank you for watching my videos. Thank you for helping me get my views up. And um, it always helps go towards getting me a YouTube check, which will help me.
continue to go. All right, guys, thank you so much. I appreciate you all. Have a great night. Bye.